Hey y'all, this is Nikki. Welcome back. I'm coming at you guys today with a recipe of how I make my turkey neck soup. Yes, I've already washed and cleaned my turkey necks here and the seasonings that I'm going to use is garlic powder, onion powder, adobo, and I'm going to use that chicken gravy mix. Um, y'all know me, I like to do my homemade gravy, but I'm going to twist it up a little bit today. I see this chicken gravy mix, so I'm going to go ahead and use that in this recipe. And I got some um, ground black pepper, and I got some chicken cubes. I have, this is one onion, this is one bell pepper, and this is, um, I don't know how many carrots, but this is carrots chopped up, and I got some garlic cloves chopped up. And I got my um, potatoes over here. I'm going to finish chopping those up once I put the meat in this um, instant pot, guys. So my first step, I'm going to go ahead and season this meat because I already put it in the insert for the instant pot. I'm going to go ahead and season this meat. Okay, I got my um, turkey next here. I'm going to go ahead and start seasoning the meat. I'm going to first put the adobo seasoning in there. Adobo. Put a little garlic powder. Onion powder. Put black pepper in there. I got two chicken bouillon cubes. I'm gonna drop those in there. And I'm gonna put my onions in there. I'm gonna go ahead and put my bell peppers in there. My onions and bell pepper. And I got a few garlic cloves, so I'm going to drop down in there. And normally I would like to use some kind of broth, but I don't have any. So right now I'm just going to put uh, four cups of water. I put four cups of water in there. I said I put uh, two, but I'm going to go ahead and put four chicken bouillon cubes in there because it's uh, like one bouillon cube for one eight ounce. So I went ahead and put four in here. So what I'm about, about to do now is put my pan insert back into my cooker and then I'm going to let these cook for 45 minutes. And then after that, I'm going to come back and I'm going to put my um, carrots and potatoes in there. So I'm going to go ahead and, and put this insert in. I'll be right back. Okay, I have it in the pot and I'm about to turn it on. Okay, I got the pressure cooker on airtight. And I'm going to put this timer on 45 minutes. I'm going to cook this for 45 minutes and I'm going to come back. And add my vegetables in there and go for another 15 minutes. After the 45 minutes is up, I'll be back. It's got one minute left. I'm about to do a quick release after this one minute. Quickly, I'll be right back. Ooh, they look so delicious. Look so delicious. 
So they're going to cook for 45 minutes. And what I'm about to do here Daddy, now. I got you if you want to pick me up. Okay, hold up. I'm going to go ahead and add the potatoes and the carrots to it. Okay, before I put my vegetables in, I went ahead and mixed up this chicken gravy mix. And as you can see at the bottom, it, it says, um, it yells four cups. So what I did, I took my measuring cup and I did one half, well, two cups. So it's a four cup measuring cup. I did like half of that. So almost two cups. And I used this whole thing of chicken gravy mix. And I put, uh, one big heap and heap of tablespoon of flour, and that's how I made this hemp gravy slurry. And so I'm gonna pour this in before I put my vegetables in. I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in. Cause that's gonna help it make the gravy. Go ahead and pour that in. Give it just a little. Stir a little bit. <clears throat> and then I'm going to add my, my potatoes. And my carrots. Then I'm going to put this on for about 30 more minutes, and then I'll be back after that. About 30 more minutes, guys, and then I'll be right back. Okay, guys, it's almost ready. Almost ready. As soon as that air pressure goes out, and then uh, we'll be opening up. See what the final product look like, taste like. We'll be right back. Okay, guys, this is the finished product of the turkey neck soup. Don't it look delicious? Yes, yes. So delicious, delicious, delicious. So guys, if you like this video, if you will, please like, subscribe, share the video if you like it. And leave me a comment down below if you have any questions. And I will talk to you guys in the next video.